got out of college, the environmental consulting business uh, was almost non-existent at that time. This would be, you know, 83, 84, 85. And uh, decided to take a, uh, you know, take a jump. An old buddy of mine from grad school uh, and I ended up on a project together in Hawaii back in the late 90s. And he's the one that convinced me to, to come to Exponent. And I got here in 99 and uh, haven't looked back. It's been a great, great run. Our firm used to be known as uh, Failure Analysis Associates. And that's still a lot of what we do is why things go wrong. Uh, we have about a thousand people, uh, about 700 of them are technical. We count the, you know, the Fortune 50 among some of our best clients. I think one of the great advantages, although I didn't go there for this in any way, was that broader liberal arts education. I took a course in Native American literature that still stays with me. I just think that was a fantastic class, uh, really opened my eyes. I'm just happy that I had that opportunity to take the broader set of classes. I really consider myself very fortunate, and I have an opportunity to give a little bit back, and to have had the uh, the opportunity, you know, given me by by what I learned at Fort Lewis, and not just the technical material, but also the skills to continuously learn. You know, when I think of, of uh, you know the good people of Colorado in, in the 1970s who paid for my education. You know, I think I think alumni who can, who have the wherewithal, you know, kind of need to step up to the plate. I am so grateful and thankful to the experience I had at Fort Lewis. Yeah. But uh, but do miss Colorado. For sure. You know, do miss Colorado for sure.